So this team consists of the staff of SIFT. And so we've been working together, some of us, for decades. And so we have this great rapport from working on all kinds of hard, challenging problems. And so we started just putting that focus onto the AICC challenge. We have our cyber people that came in, especially helping with the fuzzing side of things, understanding these bugs, the static analysis. And we have the AI people coming in and contributing knowledge about how to use these LLMs, the frameworks built on top of them. It seems to me like a perfect synergy for SIFT. So we released Shop3, which is an AI planning tool. It uses hierarchical task networks, which is sort of a niche product that is used by AI planners, people doing research in that area. We've been maintaining that for decades with a lot of people from around the country. And so that's been great, but of course it doesn't get a lot of legs because it's a very niche product. So we're really looking forward to uh, releasing our lacrosse software and having more people using it to build on. We've been doing AI planning for decades. The complexities about reasoning about software have been extremely challenging, right? That has been in the domain of only human reasoning for the longest time. The LLMs are now putting that into reach where if you can then focus them on a specific area, find a flaw, say using a fuzzing technique that will pop out, say there's something funny with this function, then you can use the LLMs like a laser beam to focus on that. Whereas even if we'd found the problem with fuzzing before, fixing was always very challenging. You were limited to the kinds of fixes you could do. When I imagine five years ago, I would have had trouble teaching an AI what I knew about cybersecurity. And now my problem is these things are going so rapidly and at scale and finding bugs and patching bugs. My knowledge is sufficient to keep up and verify what the AI system is telling me it's fixed. So that's striking. It's kind of a role reversal.